my friends welcome to season three championship rumble can you believe it we've made it through three seasons today's rumble we have the 30 winners of the previous 30 rumbles from season three and we're gonna see who's gonna take it we have a couple um, stars in here that have seen their fair share of their championship runs in championship rumbles uh, we do have one returning champion so let's see maybe he can become a two-time champion but we won't know until the end let's find out who do number one number one we have City Walk Guy. He won the South Park Rumble. So let's see how well he does at number one. Hopefully you guys have all enjoyed uh, season three with all the themes that I have thought of during this season. Um, hopefully next season for season four I'll have more themes. If not, it'll just be random people, just every now and then, just random superstars. Let's see who number two is. From No Holds Barred, we have Rip Thomas. He won the Last Chance Rumble. In our previous Rumble. Because he was one of the remaining people in one of the Rumbles that he was in. I believe he was in the 80s movies rumble and he was a runner-up so he was able to have a second chance at a rumble and he actually won it so let's see how well rip does against city walk guy too bad zeus isn't in this one that would be quite interesting seeing zeus and rip go at it but i think Rip and City Walk Guy. I think that will be a good matchup to start things off tonight. So sit back, relax, grab some popcorn, grab a soda, water, Red Bull, Monster, whatever your poison is, and enjoy this championship rumble. So let's get started and see how these guys do tonight. Rip with the clothesline. Knee smash to the face. Arm breaker. Rip is going right for the arm on City Walk Guy. City Walk Guy has yet to do anything. And now I say that. He's now against Rip doing pretty well. At number three, we have season one champion Scar. This is his second championship he won the all cats royal rumble back in the beginning of season three so let's see if scar can become a two-time rumble champion scar is looking pretty well right now but it's still the early stages so we'll see you know there's always one mistake that someone does and they get eliminated pretty easily Number four, we have Nightmare Fredbear, who won the Five Nights at Freddy's Rumble. I think he'll do pretty well. Pretty big guy. These big guys seem to do much better than the little guys. So, we'll have to see. Ooh, Rip tried to close line. No one moves. Can Fredbear here eliminate Rip? And Rip is done. His championship dreams are over for this season. Number five, we have Solomon Grundy, who won the Warner Brothers Rumble. And Scar had a chance to eliminate Fred Bear, but he kind of hesitated. And he could have clotheslined him out, but he decided to try to lift him out, and he could not do it. So right now we have City Walk Guy, we have Solomon Grundy, we have Fred Bear, and we have Scar. Let's see who number six will be. And Rip 
Thomas has been eliminated earlier. At number six, we have the Destroyer. See how well this weird gentleman does here in this rumble. As you can see in my rumbles, I half the time will use characters people will know, and then a lot of times you'll see things like, what is that? I've never seen something like that. Well, you know, I, when I'm kind of looking for themed um, rumbles, I kind of run across weird looking um, animals, people, so I'm like, you know what, let's try them out and see how it goes. We have Sergeant Santa coming in at number seven. He either has won the Holiday Rumble or the All Mall Santa one. I do not remember because we have two Santas in this one. So I could be wrong, but I believe he won the Holiday one. And Solomon is safe. He was almost eliminated by the Destroyer. Scar is just kind of chilling there. Now he has his target. At number eight, we have Drybone. He won the Nintendo Rumble. Survived. Let's see how well he does at this early number. He goes right after Sergeant Santa and gets him down pretty good. What a knee smash from Scar to City Walk Guy. Scar is doing quite well for himself as he always does in his rumbles. Let's see who the next opponent is going to be. Glorilla. Glorilla. I believe he won the the Gorilla All Monkey No Monkey Business uh, Rumble. Um, I could be wrong, but I believe I'm right on that. Um, I record so many of these all, you know, in sequence that sometimes I kind of forget which rumbles some of these people are in because they're, I'm so far kind of ahead of myself on recording these rumbles. But I believe he did win the, the monkey, uh, no monkey business rumble. Right now, he's looking pretty good. He's glowing. He looks happy. And he has made one mistake. Solon Grande decides to take a rest in the corner. Scar misses with a kick. Dry Bones with a counter. City Walk Guy with a counter to the Destroyer. Dry Bones knocks City Walk Guy down. Sergeant Santa's in a submission hold. Submission holds can weaken their opponents but does no good technically because you can't surrender you have to go over the top rope on these Royal Rumbles Solomon Grande once again in the corner and is this it for Dry Bones? No, Dry Bones is safe Dry Bones throws Scar into the corner Scar counters Nightmare Fredbear still doing quite well for himself City Walk Eye was number one he is doing very well still. Ooh, Scar is almost going to get eliminated if someone sees it. And Scar will not win his second championship. The Destroyer will not move on either. This is it for Glorilla. City Walk Guy eliminates Glorilla. Is this it for Solomon Grande? Solomon Grande done. So we have Dry Bones, Sergeant Santa, Nightmare Fredbear, and City Walk Guy. We just got. Elimination after elimination after elimination. Wow. Some of these guys really mean business. They really want to get this championship rumble under their belts. What a wanton. Ooh. Low blow by Dry Bones. Nightmare Fred. Cannot decide what he wants to do with Dry Bones. Dry Bones escapes. Let's see who our next opponent is going to be tonight. Dex. Once again, one of those weird type things that I found. I was like, oh, you know what? Give them a chance. And he did very, very well in his rumble. 
he was also the only one that went from number one all the way to the end to win the Rumble. First time in the three seasons of the Royal Rumble that someone has gone from number one pick and won their whole Rumble. So pretty impressive. Let's see how well he does. At number 11, Mr. Winkle. He won the All Puppets Royal Rumble. So let's see how well he does. I believe in the All Puppets Rumble, he drew a late number. So I think he, you know, that's how he technically won his Rumble. Because I don't see him being able to last very long in this Rumble. But, you know, we could be surprised here. City Walk guy still doing very well until I say that. And then... He is down. At number 12, we have the Monarch. This is his second championship rumble. He did not do very well in, I believe, season two championship rumble. But let's see if he can do much better in the championship three rumble. He won his rumble, which is just a random rumble, I believe. But still, win is a win, right guys? Let's see who comes out next. Man Ray from SpongeBob. He won the Under the Sea Rumble. Uh, that was kind of a fun rumble to do. Just kind of, I was kind of looking at um, just different SpongeBob characters, and I was, you know, why not? You know, let's just do an Under the Sea. At, well, well, Man Ray is done. I couldn't even finish my sentence on talking about his rumble, and he's already eliminated. I guess he just did not want the championship that bad. City Walk guy still in, doing quite well. Nightmare Fredbear still doing very well for himself as well. They have been in; those two have been in the longest so far in this rumble. Is this it for the Monarch? No, Monarch saves himself. And Sergeant Santa saves himself. Sergeant Santa with a spine buster. Oh, Dry Bones is not eliminated. He saved himself. City Walk guy is shocked, but he just countered. Let's see if he can counter and try to eliminate Dry Bones. No, he just stuns him. DDT by Mr. Winkle. Oh, is this it? Is Nightmare Fred? What? I thought that was going to be it for Nighttime Fredbear. Or Nightmare Fredbear. But he somehow survived. Number 14, we have Bumblebee, who won the All Robots Rumble. So let's see how well he does in this one. What moves that these guys are doing on each other? I guess Ace City Walk Guy and. Nightmare Fredbear still doing quite well for each other. City Walk Guy, if I remember correctly, joined at number one, and Nighttime Fredbear, I believe, at number three or number four. Mr. Winkle, if someone would have seen that, they could have eliminated him, but they did not for some reason. So he's going to stay in for a little bit longer. What a spine buster by Mr. Winkle to Dry Bones. Surprise, Dry Bones didn't crumble because of how dry he is. <laughs> uh, Monarch and Bumblebee. Now City Walk. Neckbreaker on the Monarch. Step over on Mr. Winkle from Nightmare Fredbear. I don't think any of these eight competitors want to get eliminated. Uh, City Walk guy is now stunned. And I believe that they're just ignore him for a while. What a body slam by Dry Bones right into a headbutt. And Dex is now stunned as well. Monarch in the corner. Sergeant Santa sees him. Will Sergeant Santa eliminate Monarch? No. We're going to have a double team, double fist. See what guy gets lifted by Mr. Winkle. Mr. Winkle chokeslams him down. What a knee by the Monarch to Fred. Bumblebee and Monarch once again after each other. Dry Bones after the Monarch. 
is this ooh monarch right into the corner can dry bones eliminate and what a move by sergeant santa to stun mr winkle is this it is monarch no monarch is still in can he survive yes he does dry bones could not turn him onto his stomach to eliminate him bumblebee and dex after each other let's see how well these two go with each other and how long not very long Bumblebee, excuse me, and Nightmare Fredbear. He just cannot get him down. He finally gets him down. What a hip toss by the Monarch. What a duck down underneath that clothesline. But then he gets caught by Fred. Now Fred's trying everything he can to find someone and sneak eyes on the monarch from mr winkle neckbreaker from city walk guy to bumblebee is this it for monarch once again and yes monarch has been eliminated by mr winkle and dex is um stunned by bumblebee is this it for sergeant santa no bumblebee grabs mr winkle but mr winkle gets out of the attempted submission hold and can he get Bumblebee down he got him down to one knee every time someone's seeming to try to throw somebody out someone else stops them technically prevents them from eliminating their opponent let's see so Sergeant Santa can't decide what he wants to do. He goes right after Dex. And Fred is saved. He is not eliminated. Is this it for Mr. Winkle? Yes. I believe Mr. Winkle is... And he has been eliminated. At uh, number 15, we have Al Bundy. This is also his second championship rumble. Let's see how well he does in this one rumble. He won the 80s... TV show cartoon uh, Rumble. So congratulations there to Al Bundy for winning that one. Let's see how well he does tonight. What a takedown from Dex to Al Bundy. Now Fred tries to eliminate Dex and he misses. City Walk Guy goes right after Fred. Fred escapes. Dex goes after City Walk Guy. Suplex. Or standing holding suplex keeps going and going and down he goes Ooh, during that whole thing Bumblebee was eliminated I did not quite see who eliminated Bumblebee but Bumblebee is done let's see who's next Dex is stunned at number 16 we have Dexter and Dry Bones is eliminated by Sergeant Santa. Uh, Dexter won the 1990s uh, Rumble TV show Rumble. Ooh, City Walk Guy has been eliminated by Fred. Nighttime, or sorry, Nightmare Fred Bear is doing quite well. Now he is really going to be the MVP of this Rumble now that City Walk Guy is gone. Well, now that I say that, of course, Nightmare Fredbear is done. It looks like it's going to, for the longest type people, it's going to be between Sergeant Santa and Dex. And just coming in, Dogman. Dogman won the All-Dog Battle Royal. So let's see how well he does in this one. And right away, he is already resting. That does not look good in a championship Royal Rumble, guys. That you get hit once, and then you're already resting. Number 18, we have Tunnel Rat. Won the G.I. Joe Cobra Royal Rumble over in the Terradrome. So let's see how well Tunnel Rat does. Is it going to be like Man Ray and get eliminated like in two seconds? No, he does not. Sergeant Santa... Ooh, he could have eliminated Tunnel Rat, but... He was hit by Dex, and Dex decides 
go after Bundy, and Bundy is doing quite well against Dex right now. Tunnel Rat and Bundy. That's more of a matchup for each other instead of Al Bundy and Dex. And Tunnel Rat is done. He did not survive very long as well. I thought he would do a lot better in this one, but apparently it was not in the game for him tonight. Um, just coming in, we have Bob the Pig, who won the Pig Battle Royal. So let's see how Bob does against his foes here. Let's see who comes out next. At number 20, we have Carl Winslow. So Carl Winslow is the one who won the 90s TV slash cartoon rumble. And Dex, uh, Dexter, sorry, I believe won the 90s movies rumble. And no one sees Sergeant Santa just against the ropes. So Sergeant Santa is going to be safe for right now. What a headbutt by Bob. And Dexter is out by Sergeant Santa. Some of these people are not lasting very long here tonight. 21, we have Santa Claus. Let's see if him and Sergeant Santa will go after each other and see which Santa is best. Because we had one Santa win the Holiday Rumble. And then we had one that won the All Santa Mall Royal Rumble. I believe the Santa Claus won the Santa Claus Royal Rumble. And like I said, Sergeant Santa, I believe, did the won the holiday one. Carl Winslow on the ground getting a rest. Once again, every time I see this dog man, he is in the corner just chilling. He's not doing very well, but I mean he's surviving. He's not like Man Ray and Tunnel Rat where he got eliminated right away. He's just, I believe he's just a, a weak person. But, you know, maybe that's his strategy tonight and we'll keep him going until the end. At number 22, we're at the Monster. I can't believe we're already at number 22. Wow. This Rumble's kind of going by pretty fast here. Well, is this it for Dogman? No, Dogman survives. Can Al Bundy get rid of Dex? He throws him in the corner. And he tries to lift him up, but... Oh, Bob the Pig is done. He got eliminated by Sergeant Santa. Now I might have to go back and rewatch this and see how many eliminations Sergeant Santa has. He may be the MVP of the Championship Rumble for eliminations. Carl Winslow is doing pretty well for himself. The monster takes down Carl Winslow. And Dex takes down the monster. Dex takes down Carl Winslow. Dex goes right after Santa Claus. He's doing quite well for himself. Is this it for Santa Claus? Throws him into the corner. What a hit. No, Santa Claus decides to counter. And bam. Dex is down by Santa. Ooh, Santa and Sergeant Santa. One on one here. Let's see how well they do against each other. Sergeant Santa with a... No, not a super... Ooh. Santa tried to do a reverse super kick on Sergeant Santa, but missed. Um, let's see. Oh, number 23 is coming out. Victor Armstrong. He won... I want to say he won the uh, Freaks Battle Royal. Um, I can't remember. Now, the monster eliminated by Al Bundy. Way to go, Al. Dogman goes behind Al. Is this it for Al? Is Al Bundy done? And Dogman eliminates Al Bundy. Al Bundy will not see a championship in his future anytime soon maybe he'll make it into season four championship but who knows if Al Bundy will return for season four Victor in the corner 
Carl Winslow. Can he survive the decks? And Carl, yes, survive. Sergeant Santa uh, and Dogman. Santa Claus and Dex. Victor and Carl Winslow. Let's see, Victor and Santa Claus. Dex and Victor. Santa Claus is just kind of chilling now. Whoop. Dogman sees him. Dogman misses with some kind of move. Kind of moves out of the way of Santa Claus. Number 24, we have Winnie the Pooh. And Dogman is eliminated by Santa Claus. Let's see how well Winnie the Pooh does. What a matchup. Winnie the Pooh and Carl Winslow. Well, that was short-lived. Victor throws Winnie the Pooh into the corner. Is this it for Winnie the Pooh already? Winnie the Pooh just came in. If Victor can just roll him over onto his stomach, Pooh will be eliminated. But no, Pooh survives a little bit longer. We have Sergeant Santa and Santa Claus once again out of reach after each other. Can Carl Winslow get rid of Dex? Ooh, another opponent coming in. At number 25, we have Chicken Bone Destroyer. He won the very first Rumble of Season 3, the All Don't Be Chicken Royal Rumble. So let's see if he can win his first Championship Rumble. He has a pretty good number, so he has a really good chance. Is this it for Sergeant Santa? Sergeant Santa survives. Pooh Bear could not get rid of him. Is this it for Carl Winslow? Can Santa Claus eliminate him? And he super kicked him. And yes, Carl Winslow is done. At number 26, we have Zombie Cena, who won the all Zombies Rumble, as you all can probably figure out. Zombie Rumble, Zombie Cena. Ha uh ha -huh ha. -huh. Anyways, Santa Claus goes right after Zo Zombie Cena. Zombie Cena is down. Chicken Bone Destroyer right after Santa Claus. Dex knocks down Sergeant Santa. Victor and Dex. Dex and Pooh. What a clothesline by Pooh to Dex. What a super kick by the Bone Destroyer. And Bone Destroyer once again still going right after Zombie Cena. Dex knocks down the Bone Destroyer. Sergeant Santa and Dex are after each other. Ooh, double team on Sergeant Santa. Down goes Sergeant Santa. Santa Claus and Pooh Bear are after each other. Well, for a second. What a backbreaker. Santa does not want to get eliminated by a zombie Cena. The Destroyer throws Santa Claus into the corner, but Pooh Bear prevents the Destroyer from going after Santa Claus. At number 27, we have Coke Cane Bear. Let's see how well he does. Um, I do not remember which rumble that he won, but um, it might have been the All Animal Rumble. I, I say I record so many of these, and so much, you know, after each other, um, and I'm so far ahead of myself on my recordings. It's sometimes hard to remember which ones I record and which rumbles they're in. And Sergeant Santa is done for this championship rumble. We have a cocaine bear and a Pooh bear. And cocaine bear is eliminated by zombie Cena. Pooh in the corner from Santa Claus. Can Santa Claus eliminate Pooh bear? Can he get him up? He has gotten him up. But can he roll him onto his stomach to eliminate him? Victor gets Cena into the corner. Can he lift him up? No, Pooh Bear survives. Well, Cena is up. Can Victor turn him over? If he turns him on his stomach, he is eliminated. No, Cena decides to want to stay in this rumble for just a little bit longer. Let's see how well he does. Victor into the corner. Do a little rest. The Bone Destroyer doing a little rest. Pooh Bear doing a little rest. What a slam by Dex to Cena. Pooh Bear and Dex. Is this it for Dex? Can Pooh Bear eliminate him? He misses with the hit. Finally hits him. Ooh. At number 28 we have Jason who won the 1980s movies Royal Rumble. After um, three seasons I've had Jason 
in so many different Royal Rumbles, and he finally won his very first Rumble in Season 3. Now he is in a Championship Rumble. Let's see if he can actually get a championship under his wings. We got Santa Claus and the Bone Destroyer. We got Victor and Cena. Dex is done. Number 29, we have Farmer Baby. Farmer Baby, of course, won the Farmer's Royal Rumble. And what a clothesline from Cena to Victor. Bone Destroyer just kind of not knowing what to do. Jason in a bear hug, but he is escaping. The Bone Destroyer and Jason. Dex is trying to find his next opponent. Technically his next target. Now he's taunting to the crowd saying, hey, look at me. I'm still here, guys. I've been in this rumble the longest. Pooh Bear with a side super kick. What a body slam from Victor to Santa Claus. Farmer Baby and Z takes down Cena. Bone Destroyer is now stunned from Dex. Oh, Dex tried to do some kind of maneuver, but he was prevented from running into somebody else. Let's see, Pooh Bear is taking a rest. Santa Claus is taking a rest. If Pooh Bear was not there, Dex could have put Cena against the ropes and tried to eliminate him. Victor trying to eliminate Jason. Ooh, what a move from the farmer. And Dex knocks Cena down. Pooh Bear and Dex once again. Can Pooh Bear? No. I thought he was going to go for elimination, but Dex counters. And... Pooh Bear counters with a DDT onto Dex and stuns him. Keeps hitting at him Why he's stunned. He should just pick him up and just throw him over. Victor carrying Santa Claus all over the place and throws him to the ground. Jason and Pooh Bear. Victor and Santa Claus. What a move from Victor to stun Santa Claus. Jason stunned by Dex. We have three stunned superstars. Two superstars that are resting in the corner. We got Cena and Victor after each other. We got Pooh Bear and a stunned Santa. Everyone's going kind of looks like they're after Dex who has been in this rumble the longest. Uh, ooh, what a clothesline from Jason. If Jason did not clothesline Pooh Bear, I think he could have eliminated the Dex. But Dex is probably going to stay in this one unless Pooh Bear sees what's going on and can eliminate him. No, he does not see him. He had an opportunity. He had a couple opportunities to eliminate him, and chooses not to. Jason and Dex. What a move from Santa Claus. Santa Claus picks up the farmer. Ooh. What a counter from the Santa Claus. And a clothesline. Jason and the farmer. And the farmer baby does not go anywhere. Cena and Bone Destroyer. Cena and Pooh Bear. And Pooh Bear is stunned. Santa Claus after the zombie Cena. Zombie Cena, can he be eliminated? Can he choke him out? Can Santa Claus get rid of zombie Cena? That'll be big for Santa Claus if he can get rid of zombie Cena. And what a power slam from Victor to the farmer baby. But some zombie Cena survives. Now he's going to attempt to eliminate Santa. No, he decides not to. What's Victor doing? Ooh, what a hit from Victor. Is this it for Pooh Bear? No, Pooh Bear survives an elimination. Can Pooh Bear eliminate the Bone Destroyer? No, Dex prevents it. Can Jason get rid of the Farmer Baby? If he can turn him over, he'll be eliminated. Bone Destroyer, can he get rid of Santa Claus? No. And Jason does get rid of the Farmer Baby. That is it for the Farmer Baby. Better luck next time if you have another chance. Victor 
on his way to being eliminated, but no, no one sees it. Ooh, Zombie Cena gets rid of Jason. Jason has tried so hard over the last three seasons to get this, you know, to get to a championship rumble. He gets to the championship rumble and comes up short. Can Dex, who's been in this rumble the longest, get rid of Zombie Cena? All he's got to do is turn him onto his stomach and he is eliminated. What is Pooh Bear up to? Throws Victor into the corner. What kicks by Pooh Bear to Victor? Oh, we still have some more um, opponents to come in. Uh, we're at number 30, so this is the last entrant. At number 30, we have Buff Alien. Let's see how well he does. I thought we were all done. I thought we were on our final, like, six opponents. But apparently, there was still one to go. So, we are now down to our final seven people for this championship rumble. One of these seven will be victorious and be season three champion. And can Victor get rid of Dex? Dex, like I've said, has stayed in the longest. And I think he is doing the best out of everybody, but... If he can just hold on just a little bit longer. But we got two people trying to eliminate him. No, he survives. Santa Claus and Pooh Bear. Santa Claus with a couple hits on Pooh Bear. Was that it for Pooh Bear and Pooh Bear? No. Pooh Bear survives. I thought that was it for him. I thought Santa Claus really got him. What a hip toss from Pooh Bear to Bone Destroyer. Drop kick from Pooh Bear to Santa Claus. Pooh Bear... And Bone Destroyer. Is this it for Bone Destroyer? And Bone Destroyer is done. Pooh Bear eliminates him. Buff Alien gets Pooh Bear down. Pooh Bear gets right back up because he sees Dex and he wanted to go after him, but Dex with the clothesline knocks Pooh Bear down instantly. Victor taking a rest in the corner. Santa Claus and Zombie Cena. Pooh Bear and Zombie, Zombie Cena. And is this it for Zombie Cena? Yes. Pooh Bear eliminates Zombie Cena. We are down to two, one, two, three, four, five. Our final five competitors for season three championship. Who wants it? Who wants to take that privilege home with them and say that they won a championship Royal Rumble? We have Buff Alien. We have Santa Claus. We have Pooh Bear. We have Victor Armstrong. And we have Dex. What a move from Santa Claus. And right into the bear hug from Dex. Buff Alien sees Victor down, goes right after the ankle. This gives Pooh Bear kind of a chance to just kind of chill and kind of think of a strategy. And kicks Buff Alien. And ooh, Buff Alien was almost eliminated, but he survives. Way to go, Buff Alien. Ooh, what a move from Pooh Bear. But Alien gets right back up. What a clothesline from Dex to Alien. Santa Claus in the corner. Is he checking his naughty list? Is he checking his nice list? What is Santa Claus doing? Is he going to do a dirty tactic? Let's see. What a knee from Santa Claus. He had to think about what he wanted to do. He had the opportunity to think about it for a second and... It prevailed for him, but he gets him instantly thrown into the corner. Can Pooh Bear eliminate him? Is Santa Claus going to survive? Yes, he does. Victor and Alien after each other. Dex and Santa Claus is stunned. Dex and Pooh Bear once again. This has been a matchup for quite a while, and is this it for Dex? Oh, what a miss from Pooh Bear. Why does he keep going for him? If I was Pooh Bear, I would have kept going for him. I think he could have clotheslined him out, but Pooh Bear decides to go after Victor instead. Alien should really see what's going on, and he does, and it's too late. Dex decides... Oh, Pooh Bear has been eliminated. We're down to our final four. Anyways, Alien was 
had the opportunity to eliminate Dex, but did not. Santa Claus in the corner, counters with an elbow. Suplex from Victor to Santa. We got Buff Alien knocking down Victor. Victor getting up, Santa Claus getting up, Dex getting up. And, ooh, Victor has been eliminated. I believe by Dex, I was too busy watching Alien and Santa Claus and how Santa Claus couldn't hold him up. We are down to the final three, ladies and gentlemen. My friends, these three are going to determine who's going to win this season three rumble. Who do you got? Who do you think has what it takes to win the championship rumble? I'm kind of going for uh, Dex myself since he's been in there the longest and he's doing quite well. And is this it for Santa Claus? And Santa Claus is done. It's between Buff Alien and Buff Alien and Dex. Buff Alien taking a minute to chill. Like I said, when Dex came in, in his Royal Rumble, he drew number one. He went all the way to win his Rumble. So that's why I have a feeling Dex has the opportunity to win this Rumble. But Buff Alien could have something up his sleeve or in his shorts, technically, since he has no sleeves. You know, and pull out a victory. But it's hard to say. German suplex into a ripcord. To a lariat clothesline. And Buff Alien is done. Dex has won the Season 3 Championship. Congratulations to Dex for winning his Rumble here today. He survived, he was in there the longest. He was, the, I believe, the MVP as well of this Rumble. Congratulations once again to Dex. Thank you so much for joining us here for the Season 3 Championship. And thank you for all who subscribed to this channel so far. And hopefully Season 4 brings more surprises and more great rumbles to come. I'll see you guys later. Thank you so much.